more on that dangerous winter weather affecting several parts of the country. Black ice and whiteout conditions, a major concern this morning. So our Gio Benitez is on the road showing us all what we can do to keep the family safe. Good morning, Gio. Good morning, Lara. We are in the ABC News Road Cam with our team here on the I-95 corridor, that famous corridor. Lots of accidents happen here. And this morning we're talking about black ice. That's that invisible sheet of ice on the roads during these frigid temperatures. You can't see it, but you definitely can feel it. From a dramatic snowy pileup in Ohio involving a tractor trailer to five cars slipping and sliding into each other in Vermont, whiteout conditions and invisible black ice are wreaking havoc on the roads in this winter storm. Remember that massive 170 car pileup in Michigan just last month? In the midst of blinding lake effect snow, a truck full of fireworks exploding, one person killed. But this morning, there are things you can do right now to stay safe on the roads. First, know when black ice forms. If rain is falling and the air is at 32 degrees or below, chances are black ice is on the road. Slick looking road, no water on my windshield, below freezing. These are ingredients for cars to skid out and crash. It's most likely to form on shaded roads and on bridges and overpasses. If you hit black ice, don't hit the brakes. Just lift your foot off the accelerator. And don't overcorrect your steering if the car slides. Keep in mind, it'll take at least twice as long for your car to stop on black ice. And while you're usually trying to avoid snow on the road, if you hit black ice, head toward that snow. You'll want your tires to grab hold of it. All right, some great tips. We thank you so much, Gio.